So here we go. Here's my MRI day for um, new MS lesions or what's causing my flare-up. So I'll let you know what the results are. So we made it home from Fort Collins. I had my MRI and they sent me the results and it's so hard to understand how to read those but from what I got from it was they I have no new lesions for MS which is good um, but I am they did notice some worsening um, of some old lesions in my c-spine so I'm gonna call my doctor tomorrow and just confirm you know that information and ask her you know are my symptoms MS related I just kind of need more of a cut and dry answer instead of trying to read those results if anybody out there knows what I mean um, they send you a test result and every single word is a foreign word <laughs> so it's it's really hard to understand so I just want to make sure you know I read some of those things right and get confirmation on you know the MS symptom part of it so anyways I'll keep you updated on what they say alrighty good to be home Hello and welcome to my channel. I wanted to go ahead and vlog a update on my MS. Um, I had posted an initial video that I thought I was having an MS flare up and experiencing like all of the symptoms that you could possibly feel when you have MS. And they were just getting so intense and I just thought, oh no, here we go again. You know, it's been quite a while since I've had a relapse and I just, you know, was so scared about this turning into a full-blown relapse. So, let me take a sip. I'm getting a little... So, what's going on with me is we ended up going... I have to travel about two and a half hours away to get my MRI done. And my, that's where my doctor is, my neurologist. And we scheduled the MRI and I actually had my, my brain scanned and my C-spine scanned. So we got the results back and thank goodness it wasn't, um, I don't have any new MS lesions. Um, the MS is stable. So hallelujah, so thankful for that. Sorry about my my laundry there, if you can hear that. Got my washer going. Um, also, I wanted to say that um, even though it was an MS, I have um, some bulging discs in my neck, um, basically in my C2 and my C3 spine area and so come to find out um, when you have that in those particular areas in the two and three it can mimic MS symptoms so I'm like oh great well so I feel like I'm having MS symptoms but it's not MS so it's kind of ironic I don't know what the word is but I'm just yeah, I'm just like, wow, okay. So I don't have MS flare up, but yet I'm feeling all the MS symptoms. So, okay. So it's basically, um, if you don't know what bulging disc is, I've done a little research because I didn't know myself, but it's where the vertebrae or the discs in your neck are inflamed and they kind of protrude out of your vertebrae and 
Yeah, they can give you headache and dizziness and numbness and tingling and like I've had all the symptoms that I would normally have with MS. So I also found out that the only way to really fix this is like maybe some physical therapy. Um, so that's my next step. I've got a call in to our local hospital, which is just down the street. And we're going to start some physical therapy and see if that helps. Um, I asked, you know, can this turn into something worse? And she said, yes, it can become herniated, which is, um, yeah, definitely a worse situation, um, possible surgery, that kind of thing. And I'm like, no, I do not want that. So I'm going to just hopefully get this taken care of and get it healed with some physical therapy. Um, you know, pain medication helps a little, so I take Advil or ibuprofen. Um, massage, I need to find out if that works. I've started um, massage back in January when I thought, you know, I was having some MS symptoms and just the pain back here was excruciating. I also was having numbness and tingling like up the side of my jaw and into my ear and that was freaking me out a bit. So I thought, oh, let's get a massage and see if that helps it. So I did and it didn't seem to phase it. And then the next time I thought, well, maybe I need more intense massage so I got a deep tissue and that, I don't know if that aggravated it, but yeah, that didn't help it either. I mean, it helps me temporarily, but not for the long haul. So I was talking to a few people and they said, you know, they had heard massage isn't good for something like that. Like it almost could worsen it and bring up inflammation if that makes sense so I still have a lot of questions unanswered about this and yeah and I also got answers that it's not MS but it's something that hopefully I can work on and have a little more control over I don't know we'll see I have so many questions that I'm gonna ask the doctor and physical therapy I do have another um, MS appointment in March so I will have to write down all of, all of these questions so that I can ask and um, I know the physical therapist will probably have a lot of answers for me as well so Hopefully I can get in to see them soon in the next few days, I'm hoping. But if you're one that has this bulging disc um, or any kind of like degener degenerative disc disease, I need to um, talk with you a little bit. I need to see how you have addressed this and um, yeah, if you're one of those people, I would love for you to comment below and or just send me a direct message and just let me know, is there anything I can do to help this along, to help heal? I'm just, um, yeah, it's, um, today I'm feeling better. I have a headache, um, some tingling in my leg and foot, so... Like I said, I don't think it's he healing as of yet because I'm really experiencing the symptoms still. But uh, would love to, you know, chat with someone who knows about this and have gone through it. So just kind of curious. Alrighty. Well, that's my MS update. It's not really an MS update, but kind of is. <laughs> so. Let me, um, what I'll do is 
after I get my physical therapy done and talk to him, I'm gonna get back on and just share with you what you know he, he or she said. Hopefully it's something encouraging. Um, I just want to be able to heal this and get healthy again. So I do a lot of walks and um, hiking and walks in like April, May, June. So doing the MS walk this year as well. So if you want me to leave the link for that down below, I would love for you to either donate or become a team member. Um, you know, I'm gonna be doing more promotional type stuff for that. Um, it's very, very important for me and for those dealing with MS. So um, yeah, I'll put that link down below in my description box. So I wanted to say thank you again for following my videos and, and subscribing to my channel. That means so much to me. You, you don't even know how much. So thanks again. So have a great day. Take care. God bless. Bye-bye.